Amber Heard, this strange name she chose for her new life in a Spanish town. Since the conclusion of the highly publicized trial in which she lost and was pitted against her ex-husband Johnny Depp, Amber Heard has become more discreet. What then develops the actress? She simply left the United States and left her belongings in Spain. More specifically, on the island of Mallorca. According to the local newspaper, Amber sought refuge in Costex, a little town with 1,300 residents away from the media commotion and tourists. She has lived there since the beginning of last summer along with her one-and-a-half-year-old daughter, Oana Page, and Italian companion Bianca Buddy, the photographer's director. The actress had chosen to settle in this small community, but she had done so first under a false name. Lekel? Calamity Jane, a symbol of the Western conquest, was the pen name for Martha Jane Cannery. Amber quickly located her marks in this village. She lives as a madam around the world, almost invisibly, I saw her several times, but I didn't know who she was until someone told me, a young resident told El Pays. She strolls down the street without trying to hide. Another thing to note is that Amber Heard enjoys going for walks with her daughter and visiting parks. She leads a very typical village life, as though she were from the country. Everyone keeps their distance, here, no one disturbs anyone, everyone lives his or her own life, a businessman told El Mundo. She is just like us in that she buys fruits and vegetables, speaks Spanish with a Mexican accent, is very kind, and always says hello to us. The 36-year-old comedian rented a home with an unobstructed view of the Serra de Tramontana. She would have a swimming pool and a movie theater. The local Samiti, Maria Antonia Muner, the former president of the regional parliament, is the owner of this property, according to the Espignal Daily. A woman sentenced to 14 years in jail for various financial fraud and corruption schemes. Amber Heard may have had the purpose of reserving one last little minute while awake in her own private paradise, free from concerns.